Jen here. Today I am doing a much requested video on my planner tote. I call it my planner tote but really it's just a tool bag from a hardware store and it's cost me $20 instead of those prices for the craft bags are quite large and quite expensive. So this one cost me $20 and for everyone that lives in Australia I got it from Masters. Now this is perfect for me. I don't have a study as such anymore because I just had another baby so I don't have a spare room. So this is my portable study in a way. It, it kind of holds everything that I need it to. So let's get right into it and I will show you around. Here is the front and the side. Here is the back. Actually, I think that's the front, but that's all right. And the other side. And here it is from the bird's eye view from the top. Okay, so I'll start with these side bits here. I have no idea why this is Velcroed like this. It's just one piece of um, strip with Velcro on it and I didn't know what it's actually used for but it's perfect to hold my washi so I put all my little washies here and my bigger some of my bigger washies on this side I have some on my desk as well but this is just stuff that I can bring portable with me and it stays out of the way and it's really secure okay in the front I carry this guy I have my label art, which is a Dymo. I have my little fox full of bits and pieces. I have my stickers and extra tabs and a notepad in here. I have my A5 beautiful Bible in here. My wallet slash planner in there my, and my two new additions okay so there's no pockets along the back here but you turn it around and it's got two little things in here that you can put something in I don't have anything in there at the moment you could also hang pens from there if you wanted to there's two little D-rings, one here and one on this side, and that's for a strap, the shoulder strap that comes with it, but I just carry it around, and it's also got this foamy stuff, so it's really quite easy to carry. And then I've got pockets all the way along the back here, uh, where I carry some scissors. This one's currently empty. I have my little Kiki K notepad in here, and I have my Kiki K notes and some post-it full-length lined notepads in there. So that's what it looks like empty from the inside. Now, the outside, I just have a couple of magnetic clasps that go into my planners just sitting there for when I need them. And in this pocket, it's, it's being gusseted a bit on the sides, just way down the bottom in there. And I just keep my friction pens and some highlighters and things in there. And I don't keep anything in these pockets at the moment um, because I'm opening this quite a bit and I don't want things to fall out. Okay, on this side, this is supposed to be for your tape measure, so my husband tells me. Um, but we've just stuck on some pins and hooked them on there. And they're very, very safe. They haven't come off or anything. And in this little pouch, I just keep my Repesco hole punch. It fits perfectly in there and it stays nice and closed. So he just fits right in there, nice and safe and sound and easy to access. From the front, I just have a double-sided tape. I have two, oh, close that. I have two notepads in here, sticky notepads. I have some very cute paper in here. How cute is that? The little turtle. And it fits perfectly like it's supposed like it was made for it. And in here I just have some clips. 
here from Kiki K as well I have my sticker book and behind that I have a Christmas card I got from a beautiful friend of mine on the Facebook planner pages who actually gifted me my Bible my A5 Molden brand new she is amazing I keep this in here just to always remember how wonderful people can be because that was just such an amazing gift and she's an amazing person in the back here I have my to do Kiki K notepad I have some market dots and that's the lot in there so that's the two back pockets and in this side pocket I have, there are two pouches one two in the back one I keep some more note paper and I have some stickers and some flags and some more post-it notes some envelopes and some more cute little kitty cat paper some Martha Stewart tea, um, dew drops and some Kmart dots and the Kmart version of the Martha Stewart reusable tabs not as good because they kind of they don't come off again after a day or two they're very hard to pull off so I kind of don't usually pull them off they usually stay on there permanently and that is it so I hold can hold quite a lot so it's held all that stuff not the bottle of wine in the background and everything up in there as well and it's not very heavy I really really love this it's very very sturdy and the handle moves swivels around and it is just a fantastic um, little bag it's obviously made to hold tools which are really heavy so it's really quite durable and I love it. If you have any questions please let me know. I hope you enjoy this video and I will speak to you in my next one. Bye guys. Bye.